Mm. All right. How in the world do we discern what's carnal, what's of the world, or what's spiritual? You know, are these times coming upon you uh, unaware? Are you in the darkness? No. If somebody comes up to you and they say, you know, something of the world, you know, like their problems began when COVID started, you know, and then just one excuse after another, but it's always carnal. And they never, ever talk about the darkness of this world, the spiritual, what's going on. Because everything that is going on, it's all spiritual. You know, we, yes, I know we're all in the flesh. But as it says in Ephesians 6, man, 10 through 20, you wrestle not with flesh and blood. It's all spiritual. All of it. And you'll know them by what they're doing. You know, this is not a difficult thing to discern. Yeah, I believe the violence is going to be increasing. Um, I just experienced something with somebody. And uh, from the first time that I met this person, it was, it was carnal. You know, I don't care if they're saying it's COVID. It's still carnal. It's the things that they made up. It's talking like the world is talking. Yeah, as we're told to discern and test all spirits. You know, you wrestle not with flesh and blood. And I just found out from somebody, you know, because I, I questioned him about why. You know, because he said his problem started with COVID. Then I asked him, I said, well, why didn't you just get a job? Well, he lost his identification. And then I'm thinking, okay, well, COVID was quite a few years ago. And you still haven't got any identification, you know? And then it's like, you know, and then it just got, it escalated to worse. You know, I just had somebody just like acting like he was going to try to start fighting with me, you know? And uh, he, he stopped as soon as he came right up in front of me, he stopped, you know? But he was approaching me like he was ready to do something right then and there. And uh, let me tell you something, I didn't move. I did not move, and I just let him know. I said, you just crossed the line, yeah? And I said, now you're done here. You know, you're not gonna be coming back here no more. And uh, I had to go in and let the management know. Yeah, I said, I come here a lot. And uh, and I said, this guy just approached me like he was gonna attack me. You guys, I've seen on videos where people are being attacked, you know, right now by people even that are homeless. You know, I'm telling you the spirit that abides in them. If it was the spirit of God, they wouldn't be telling you C-O-V-I-D. They wouldn't be talking about that stuff. They'd be warning you about it, but they wouldn't be blaming their problems on that. You know, I hit the road trying to warn people many years ago uh, in 2014, six years before that even began about what was coming. I said, don't do what the world is doing. You know, how will we know who it is, our brothers and sisters, okay? They're not gonna be talking like the world. You know, you'll know them, you know? Be careful, you guys. I'm telling you, it's gonna get worse. Last night in that dream, I seen like a bunch of like sticks or something. They were all like scrambled and they were scrambled around. Then they started coming together, piecing together. And it said, uh, the, uh, this is the end. You know, this is it. It's over. That's what it said. It's over. You know, this is over. That's what it said. Then it went back to being scrambled again. You know? And I'm, and I'm talking to this other guy. I go, did you just see that? Did you see that? Did you see that? And then it scrambled away. In other words, they can't see it. An evil and wicked generation will receive no signs so you'll know them by the way they're talking you know and i knew that a long time ago and i also knew he was mimicking what the world is mimicking you know and uh guns their flags all of it you know these are not the, the ways of the lord in heaven you know the whole all nations are deceived 
And you'll know these people by what they're doing and what they're saying. Okay, God bless everybody. In Jesus Christ, our Lord and our Savior.